Pager. Alright, I don't want to go back there quite yet. I think, I feel like it's cabaret time. Unless we run into some other honeys, then, I, then, then maybe not. Oh my god, I am not. I'm, I'm running away, I'm running from this girl. Until the end of time. All right, Sean. Well, thank you for tuning in while you could. I do appreciate it. And I hope you have a great night and a uh, good day at work tomorrow. Or, I guess you didn't say work. You just had to say you had to get up early. Well, I hope whatever that activity is is fun. <laughs> Not Japanese. Oh. Oh. The cook. Shihai,すぐ行く。ご案内します。ご案内します。うん。Shihai,こちらのお客様です。just have to shift my weight a bit. Oyobideshoka. Ah, what a sine, Sihanisa. Jambore and Yamisha. Antiatok. Gulanto, you miss. Oh, it is from Jambalaya. Sihanisa no gori. Well, Gogamoe. Wait, after they just kick try he tried to kick our ass? Lame. Oh, well bless you for helping your dad. <laughs> Make sure you guys stay safe and wear masks so you don't kip, kick up any germies. Oi,酔っ払う前に余計言えよ。そのリは大丈夫。私まだ寄ってないよ。リーの電話ないや。ああ。あなた、これからすぐ店抜けられるか。なあ。なんでよ。お店出たらあなた自分の家に向かう。支配人さんの家、ここから遠い。いや。そう転ぼ
Uh-oh. That can't be good. Oh, shit. So these guys, are, I think, are Yakuza. Hatches? Oh no, they all have pipes and bats. Guess I gotta get my bat out too. Excuse me. Excuse me again. Yeah, I'm not fucking with the guy with a gun. Uh, I'm taking him down first. here tonight man I love slugger style ああ、ですかい。ファンゴ。あ、しゅるのん。なんかトラブルか。らしくねえな。本愛さんが店のすぐ近くで暴れるなんてよ。ん別に何でもあるへんわ。なら店を取らかしてどこへ行く気だ。I just think I I always forget his name, but I know his face because like, I always say the guy with the sallow face. I'm not going to kill her, so why am I humoring this? Huh? Oh, yeah, it's because あんたに相談するくらいやったら電柱にでもしとく。はあ。はあ。All right. <laughs> I'm sure that I can't, but I want to see if I can do something with Sunshine. 
Also, are there like. Oh no, Aaron Coon! Oh shit. Yeah, let's check him. I've seen dumpsters happier than you. Oh, that voice. Hello again. It's my sneakers. The soles have finally worn through. They do look beat to crap. Yes, they were my favorite pair. I can't even go buy a new pair like this. He needs new shoes, huh? I'd give him some, but I ain't exactly in the habit of carrying a spare pair. What am I going to do? Don Quixote carries sneakers. Alright, so I gotta go to Don Quixote and get some sneakers for him at some point. Where is it? Is it far? Nah, it's just here. I guess I'll pick some up now. So I was watching a, uh, like, I like one of my guilty pleasures is watching fan-made, I don't want to say documentaries because they're not quite that official, but like, fan-made fact lists. I don't know how else to say it, but like, this one roller coaster channel, uh, fan channel, or theme park fan channel I was following as a result of Defunct Land, but not Defunct Land, does like top 10 roller coasters in the US, top 10 ro roller coasters of 2010, 20, that kind of stuff, like countdown lists. And it's all completely subjective, but I don't know, man, it's brain candy. Anyway, I found out from one of those countdown lists, it was like craziest Japan rides in Japan. And one of them was like an actual roller coaster that was built on top of a Don Quixote. It's 100% true story, you can look it up. It was built on top of Don Quixote and it was like immediately like out, out of service, but I think it still sits there. I don't it's, I don't think it's functional though. It'd be like going to a 7-Eleven. Yeah, I uh, I used to think that everybody rode roller coasters until I grew up and I realized that none of my friends like roller coasters except me. <laughs> I love roller coasters. And I've decided that when the world is opening back up again, I'm going to find somebody to go on roller coasters with me and make them a theme park buddy because I want I want to start going again. John hates them. He'll he'll ride very 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 like kitty ones for me like at Disneyland, but even Disneyland like he doesn't like uh he doesn't like California screaming which is like outdoors. He could deal with Space Mountain, but he doesn't like it. And he he actually likes Big Thunder Mountain. And that's about it. Anyway, Aaron Coon, here's your shoes. Here, will these do the trick? You gave away a pair of sneakers. I can have these, really? Thank you so much. I'll put them on right now. They're so shiny. Wow, these sneakers are great. They feel wonderful. These are the latest style too, aren't they? Oh man, are they cool. I should go for a run in them. It would be a waste not to. <sighs> hey, did you forget the whole reason you got into this mess? Think you ought to take it easy, maybe? I'm just not a big fan of boomerang ones. Going back backwards at high speed without being able to see isn't fun. I... How do I put this? The idea of not being in control of the situation is what I like about it, but I also, like, obviously have limits. I I actually prefer roller coasters because I feel safe. Like, I'm riding a fast car. That's how it feels. Whereas if I'm, like, on a Ferris wheel or something that's, like, swinging or suspended or, like, a gondola ride, I can't do those. Like, I don't like heights, but with roller coasters, you only really are dealing with the heights when you're at the peak of the hill. And if it's like a chain lift roller coaster, and usually then I just look ahead, I don't look to my sides, then I, I don't even notice it. But, um, like, I'm not thinking about how high up I am usually because I'm moving so fast. But if it's just heights, like a Ferris wheel or something, or even like a, uh, like I said, like a gondola ride, something made for kid like kids, I can't do it. It scares me. Hey, Mikolas. Oh, that's right. I couldn't contain myself. I'm so happy. Huh. Getting happy makes you want to run. That's a thing. I, he I hear that all the time. I was on the track team in college. Running is in my blood. You're a strong runner than I take it. Hey, Zarok. <laughs> Welcome back. Yes, I am. But I've been running too much without taking the proper precautions. That's how I ended up injured. Let me guess. You're still running errands? Yeah. I can't stand the thought of not seeing her happy. 
Oh, I'm keeping her waiting. I have to go. Thank you so much for these sneakers. I'm doing great. I had a day off from work today, so I spent today doing all sorts of stuff around the house, including cleaning. And Persona is an Atlas game, but it was purchased by Sega not too long ago. Deacon. Disney has loops. Space Mountain definitely has inversions, and so does California Screamin'. Wow. So apparently I am the only crazy bitch that likes roller coasters. <laughs> My ex didn't like him either. John doesn't like him. I'm just like... Argh. I, I have a... Chris, my friend Chrissy sometimes will ride them with me. But that's about it. Yeah, Space Mountain does loop-de-loops, but you're in the dark, so you don't really notice that you're doing it. Thunder I love Thunder Mountain. I want to go back to California and go to Magic Mountain and ride that crazy shit like X2. I want to ride that crazy shit. I would never like bungee jump or do any of those crazy, like, you know that uh, theme park that's like at the top of a building in Vegas? All of those rides are really simple, but it's, they're all like insane. I would not ride a single one of those. Not a single one. Even though they're only a couple seconds long. Or I wouldn't do any bungee jump rides or any of those slingshot rides. Mm -mm -mm. I like specifically roller coasters. I don't really like all thrill rides. I've heard El Toro is really good though. I, I've heard that Six Flags Over Georgia is actually one of the more legit ones, and I haven't gone, so when things are settled, I, I think I might go. I'll do like a vlog video. いつよ、誰にも誰にでも他人に縁裏があるもんや。とにかく誠のとこ行くときは用心するんや。さっきグランドの前で絡まれとったやろ。お前の素性は言うべ、誠さらに来たヤクザにも割れとる。どっから見られとるか分からんでいい
this door, maybe? Here it is. Son of a bitch really had a secret passage. It's supposed to connect to the building next door. I guess I'll see for myself. Look at this little door. Ah, oh, back at the Sunshine Club. Never thought something like that was here yesterday. Even if I was being followed before, I'm clear now. Now to haul ass to where the girl is. Alright, so I gotta go check on Makoto. Gotta go see Bay. There we go. Good, nobody's looking. If I'm going in, now's the time. Whoa, can you see that? Oh. <laughs> Listen, I've trained very long and hard for that expat. These shoes are so good. Do you gotcha? Futo. なんか入ってたの。I like that Lee can't be bothered to put anything on but sweatpants. Is Lee based on a real person? I assume yes. He looks like he has a real person face. Oh shit. Oh shit, we got a black widow. Oh shit, we got a black widow. What? Oh, he probably doesn't want her to hear this. You could have just asked her to leave. It seems a little extreme. Yakuza? Dash? I was gonna say, she looks like Makoto. Mikoto。Oh,shit。死体があれば雇い主は納得する。せやからその写真の女には誠の身代わりにしたいんだってもらうんや。な、なんやて。わしとお前でやる。Oh, so he wants us to kill her and then take credit for killing Makoto. この服着せてな。We're going to stage a murder. Cause this girl looks like Makoto. And he's basically saying, like, kill this girl. Mm -hmm. But do we trust him? 
そんなん札が調べたらすぐバレるやろが大丈夫や女殺した後はその顔をなお誰かわからんようにしてしまえばいい指紋も薬で焼いてあるんやお前は何なんや Some breaking bad shit Breakingly Listen I get it We're not exactly in the morality business here And she sounds like a murderer So I understand the Dexter logic ただのハリスとちゃうやろ。なんとか言わんかい。わしも元はあんたと同じ殺し屋や。なんやと。大陸系の組織に雇われとった。so he's probably former Chinese mafia or something. Hantoshima. <laughs> あんとしまい。わしは組織に雇われて韓国系の連中を襲撃した。女の死の身巡ってごたついとったんや。その時までにこっちも何人かやられとった。倉庫におったんは2人。そいつらを始末してみるとそこに反乱の女がぎょうさ
を知っとるんやポケ最後にもう一遍聞いとくわしの話に乗る気はほんまにないんやなないなそうかそしたら黒に染まった門の流儀教えたるわ How many times are we gonna have to fight Lee? What if I let Lee beat my ass? Because I feel like that's what I want to happen. <laughs> I don't want to fight Lee. When Hailee. I want him to beat my ass. I love his fighting style, very Chinese. I have to win. Oh shit. tricks. Ooh. Oh, I missed that one fuck. Didn't I? I think I I think I did. Winners who use bro strats. I just, I don't know. I don't, I, I assume this hasn't been the type of game where losing is really a choice. So I assume that I have to beat him to progress. I would have been more apt to disagree if it gave me like an actual choice prior to fighting him, but whatever. Right, my armpit. Yeah, I'm gonna lose all my... All my boost. Oh, oh my gosh! Mari, thank you so much for the raid. I'll give you a proper thank you in a moment. Hey guys, hello everybody, welcome. Hi Raven. Hi Mari, how are you? What were you playing tonight? Hello everybody. We're just playing some Yakuza 0 again tonight. No, I didn't die, I won. まことの死体が必要や。このままやったら、いつかまことんとこにお前以外の殺し屋が来る。それよりまえにお前もやられるで。お前はもう死んだる。いや、ゴーシンダル。<笑><笑> It's going good. Um, did lots of errands today. I had a day off. So just spending an evening playing some Yakuzis. 
Raven0237. Thank you so much for the follow. I get up that follower goal now. Majima. Jay Texan, thank you so much for the follow. Let me change that again. Did you say what you were making tonight, Shadow? Oh, gotcha. Well, how much does it differ? Because I've only ever played classic. I've never played full body. Damn, stone cold. Man, I did not very much like how that went. Tonight was tacos. Oh, that sounds awesome. And you made them yourself, right? Classic is just a lot more unforgiving. Yeah, I remember it being difficult. Like, I think I at some point had to switch to, like, easy mode or something. For sure. Now I want to make some tacos. Well, you also get the third Catherine in full body as well, right? <laughs> Just like another one. I don't even remember that one, Mari. I also played Catherine the year it came out, which I I don't even know when that is, but it's gotta be at least a decade ago. Yeah, Rin is exclusive to full body. Oh, Rin. I don't know why I thought it was another Catherine. This makes three days. Didn't wind up changing much, if anything. Things are worse now than before. Jigs up as soon as Sag Sagawa finds out I'm keeping the girl alive. Can't risk heading to the storehouse now. Better play it cool and head to the Grand like normal. Alright, back to- Oh, hey! Oh, look at this suit! That's how you know he's serious. Hey, hold up a sec, will ya? Hmm? Uh -huh. Ain't she that guy Majima who runs the Grand? Huh? Yeah, that's uh. me. Thought so. How you doing? Making mad moolah? I do alright for myself. How about you? Uh, you really gonna ask that? Uh, you're the one who brought it up, smart guy. To tell you the truth, I got serious money problems. You don't say! I just, I, I, unbelievable. That's, that suit screams fabulous wealth to me. And serious business. Huh? Well, well, the bag of Majim is closed. Sorry. <laughs> no, no. The trouble is, I got more cash than I can use. Say what? I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. I'm curious. Are you for real right now? Well, what else am I going to do? No matter how much I spend, I can't get rid of it. I took it to the bank, but they said they ain't got enough room in the vault. Figured people take some off my hands if I played them a song or two. Why not skip the tunes and just give it out? Ah, you got me there. I see why they call you Lord of the Night. <sighs> I still want to try Yakuza. It looks so good. Mari, you have to play Yakuza, at least in some capacity, if only for a little bit. Because you have, like, the insider Japan knowledge, you know what I mean? You're gonna get all of these references and shit that they're making. And it's like... It's, like, really weeby, but in, like, the best way. Where everything's, like, funny, it's tongue-in-cheek. The cultural references are very, like, uh, authentic. In ways that, like, they don't try and mask it like they do in maybe some of the other games. When they localize. And, uh, anyway, it's just been a ton of fun. And Zero, in particular, is a great starting point for the story, everybody's told me. I can't compare it, it's the only one I've played so far. But um, it's also awesome because not only is it the first installment in the series, it takes in place in Japan in the 80s. So it's like additionally tacky. <laughs> it's so good. What's that got to do with anything? And you're really that rich? Feels more like you're yanking my chain. Oh, is my wealth that obvious? I try not to flaunt it too much, but when you're the king, you've got the aura of bling. Ain't no way to hide my highballer vibe. Yeah. 
Uh, I hate to break it to you, but you look more like a cross between a lounge singer and a used car salesman. Huh? Seriously, the sleaze is just oozing right off you. What? Well, you're nothing like the type who shows up at my club and throws money around, that's for sure. Oh yeah, thought you might say that. What, so you're admitting it? It's been stressing me out. I really am rolling in dough, but for whatever reason, people think I look like the human embodiment of a gutter. Are you trying to tell a sob story? Cause it ain't working. Yeah, it's such a it's such a tone shift from what we were just doing. What I'm trying to do is find a way to show my wealth, but that's when I heard the rumors about you, Majima-san. So did Bori's Lord of the Night. First time I saw you on the street, guys and girls were falling over themselves left and right to get you, your good in your good graces. <laughs> yeah, I don't exactly like the attention, but you don't seem rich at all, Majima-san. Sure, you look flashy on the outside, but it feels like an act to me. I could see the veneer peeling off. Oh, hope I'm not offending you or nothing. Huh, guess you got some savvy after all. Yeah. Never mind. Tell me, why'd you stop me on the street if you think I'm faking it? Yeah, about that. I was thinking maybe you and I could be friends. What? I want you to show me how to act rich. And what makes you think I'd do that? What's in it for me? For you? Yeah. You may have money coming out of your ears, but I gotta work to get paid. And time is money. Don't know what to say to that. Let me ask you then, what's the difference between if you look rich or not? It's a huge difference. When you look rich, you can hit on girls without them screaming and running away. They might actually listen for a change. Who knows? Maybe ladies will start trying to talk to me and mar into marrying them. I could build up a whole harem. Huh? Well, I might know a thing or two about that. So you're just another horn dog chasing tail after all. Pretty damn pathetic. Majima's like, you gotta get the honeys for business. You do not mix romance and business. How the hell did you get rich in the first place? I don't understand this world sometimes. When it comes to money, I got all the luck. It just seems to fall into my lap. Just like how girls fall into the laps of popular guys, I guess. Okay, now you're just being a creeper. How about this then? If you help me earn some green, I'll be your pal. What? This ain't how it works. Friendship ought to be something you give away for free. Hey, Pathfinder. Welcome back. Oh, now you're gonna take the moral high ground? If you're that rich, you may as well buy a, f you f buy a few friends. Huh, so friendship can be bought. All right, I'll buy you, Majibasan. How much? What'll it take for you to hang out with me? You s your sleaze is making me s my skin crawl. If you got pockets that deep, just come to my club as a customer. Your club? Uh... If that ain't gonna fly, forget it. No cash, I walk. Oh, yeah. no. It ain't that I don't want to go. It just seems I'd have a hard time spending much cash at a cabaret. You really think so? The Grand ain't some pop-up dive bar, pal. Those girls will have you paying through the nose. Oh, don't worry. I got the money. <sighs> Gotta say, I liked the thing with the money shower before. Might give it a try myself one of these days. Oh, was this just a setup so that Majima can do this too? I gotta say, it is a little annoying that you need to go through tutorials twice, basically, anytime you unlock something with a second character. An investment fund. Me and other wealthy people around the country share info and take contributions from investors. We got the smarts to make the money work for us, so you gotta be sure you can pay dividends. Well, ain't you, Mr. Freakin' Fancy Pants. Change the subject and you're a whole new man. Neva Wong, hola, how are you? Welcome back, friend. Gah, did it again, did I? My bad. Anything money related and I run my mouth off. Us fat cats are like that. Still, ain't gotta make any profit to lose change, huh? Ain't gotta make any profit with loose change, huh? I'd have to invest big. Yeah, of course. Anyway, I've talked enough for one day. Let's get over this, uh, let's go over this some other time. Yeah, sure. You can usually find me around here, though. Come and see me again if you're interested. If you get to miss- no- Tanioka, otherwise known as Mr. Moneybags, interacting with him will gradually fill the friendship gauge. You can check the status of this gauge anytime in the pause menu's completion list. Fill your friendship with Mr. Tanioka to see what happens. Okay, I think he's kind of cool. Something's wrong with me. said go to the Grand like normal, but there's... Where am I supposed to go in here exactly?
Was I not actually supposed to do that? Sanja should head to the Grand and act natural. Okay. I'm at the Grand. I'm acting natural. Was a cutscene supposed to trigger or something? I'm just a little confused. Maybe I go upstairs. Ah, yes, that is what I was supposed to do. Just gotta go clock in, is all. はい、おはようございます。お。先ほど支配人宛に保護司会館のリー様という方からお電話がございました。うん、リーは彼に。ご存知の方ですかうん。それず、何て言うとった。え、それが支配人にすぐそのお保護司会館に来ていただきたいと
I need to upgrade my CPU so bad. Who the fuck is this? あの子はこれで死んだことになった。あんたの雇い主もこれで納得やな。あんたは消される心配はもうないっちゅうわけや。感謝してもらうな。お前何も言いや。目的は何や。取引したいんや。あんたと。何わけわからんこと。And the intrigue builds even more. Oh, please. Please. Stop. Stop molesting the staff. Can you just stop on her titty like this? Like. Don't call me stud. Well, you just know. Alright, well, speaking of Chapter 7, I guess that that was the end for us.